Hello guys, welcome back to the Civil Engineering YouTube channel. Please subscribe our channel for daily civil engineering videos. In today's lecture, we are going to find out the formula for determining the weight of the steel bar. So there is a very simple and easy trick to find out the weight of any steel bar. For example, we are going to take an example here to find out the steel bar weight. So for example, this is the steel bar here and the length of the steel bar is 10 meter. And also let's suppose let's suppose that this is a steel bar with a diameter of 12 millimeter so now how to find out the weight of the steel bar so this is a simple formula used to find out the weight of the steel bar that is W is equal to the D square divided by 162 multiplying it with the length of the bar so now here W is the weight of steel bar weight of steel bar in kilogram in kg and here d d is the diameter of the bar diameter of bar in millimeter and l is the length of the bar length of the bar and this is in meter you should keep in mind that this formula is only valid when the diameter of the bar is in millimeter and the length of the bar is in meter. So for example, we have here the steel bar with a diameter of 12 millimeter and a length of 10 meter and we want to find out the weight of the steel bar. So the weight will be equal to the W is equal to the D squared divided by 162 multiplying it with the L length of the bar. So D is the diameter of the bar which is 12 millimeter here. We know that. So it will be 12 square divided by 162 where 162 here is the constant. Multiplying it with the L length of the bar which is 10 meter. So 10 meter here. Or we don't need to write out the unit here. So this weight will be directly in kilogram. So if you multiply and divide by 162 so we get out the weight here 8.88 kilogram so this is the weight of the steel bar in kilogram when we have a steel bar of diameter of 12 millimeter and also the length of the bar is 10 meter so in this way we can find out the weight of the steel bar so i, I hope you guys understand what i mean by this formula so you should, you should also keep in mind that if the diameter of the bar is not in millimeter then you have to change the diameter of the bar in the unit of millimeter. Similarly when the length of the bar is not in meter then you have to change the length of the bar into meters. Then this formula is valid because this, for, this formula is derived for the diameter of the bar in millimeter and the length of the bar in meter then you will get the weight of the steel bar in kilogram so hope you guys understand and don't forget to subscribe our channel for daily civil engineering videos thank you for watching our video